A lot happened in the legalized cannabis, CBD, and hemp industry this week, and we are going to talk about it. In a December survey, Alaska boasted the highest adult use cannabis taxes in the country. At $57.50 paid in taxes per ounce, that's over four times higher than New Jersey's number, which was the lowest in the country this month. Former employees of adult use cannabis company TrueLeave are filing a potential class action lawsuit over their termination conditions. The laid off employees claim the company did not provide adequate notice as per the Worker Adjustment and Retraining Notification Act. TrueLeave denies any non-compliance with federal and state regulations and claims they provided severance or transfer options to the employees. The Washington Cannabis Business Association has just announced its priorities for the new year via a webinar. In 2023, businesses in the organization aim to focus on safety and interstate commerce policy. Edible Arrangements, an Atlanta franchiser that recently filed a trademark lawsuit against Green Thumb Industries, has dropped its case, citing the fast-evolving cannabis landscape. And finally, Oregon officials have committed to stricter crackdowns on the illicit market as raids on illegal farms continue. The state has been battling with illegal cannabis grow operations for months and has recently announced potential measures that would increase maximum incarceration time and fines for those involved in illegal cannabis grow operations. That's it for this week's news roundup. What cannabis industry headline caught your attention this week? Let us know in the comments.